Hello everyone and welcome back here to Plants vs Zombies. We've got an interesting and eclectic bunch of opponents here. We've got the usual cone heads and there's looks like there's a bucket head there. Um, the, the, the pogo zombie is annoying as is the balloon zombie. I think tall nuts will stop those. No, actually I don't think tall nuts will stop those. So I think uh, Arsenal, <laughs> he said Arsenal. Uh, Arsenal this time is going to include the cactus which shoots pipes, spikes that can pop balloons. So one of them, one of them, and we'll take the lily pad. Where is the lily pad? There's the lily pad. Okay, our upgrade for the puff shroom this time is going to be the cactus. And we'll take the tall nut because it will stop all known pogo zombies. Uh, we'll take squash because he's fun. We'll take... What should we take? We'll take the plantern because of the fog. And given that we have space take the cattail as well because it's such a useful card but before we go let's pop to the shop like now I'm crazy yes we know all right we'll buy some rakes there that's going to take out the first zombie of the level and we're still saving up the two th 20 thousand for nine slots uh, so let's go then deeds let's rock all right, so get some sunlight, get some defenses down. The first zombie's coming down there, so I want to get the ones that aren't going to have the first zombie coming down it. Um, first, we'll put the last shroom there. In the meantime, get as much sunlight going as we can. Two hordes this time, which is better. I do prefer the longer uh, levels to be honest with you. So there we go. Right, so we now have one zombie on each one. We'll double these up as we can. But we want to keep an eye to see where the actual zombies are coming from this time. To make sure that there's two puff rooms to, to meet them. Right, another one of these. There we go, there is two. So, right, we'll just start putting some more down. Zombies are very polite at the start of the devils and just come in one by one. It's elephants that come marching two by two, you know. Okay. Right, there we go, that's brilliant. Let's get a couple of planters down. And there we go. Right, that's the first one. And then what I think we'll do is we'll try to save up for some cattails Rains. at that point. Okay. Rains. Mm, no, let's save that just for a sec. Stick you there. Eek. Sorry, that clicked outside of the screen. Brains. Right, let's get another one of you there. There, now we can see what we're doing. These mushrooms are starting to grow, which means we can start affording to put down some cattails. Do that. Not they. Stick a tool nut in front of there. Okay. Now we definitely want. The game is not letting me save. You notice this? The game is not letting me save. I'd like to get a cat tail down while this uh, tool nut is still intact. There we go. Crunching sound does get on my nerves after a while, I gotta be honest with you. Okay. Mm, how should we deal with you? I don't want to put a cat down. down. Uh, and then instead I think I'll put a squash down. That'll help. There we 
Okay. And then I can always put a cattail down afterwards. And while I'm waiting, let's start putting down some of these. That'll do nicely. And there we go. Fill that space for the cattail. It instantly goes to work. Excellent. Alright, stick another one of those in there. It's not going to last very long. Brilliant. Okay, so... Let's save up for another cat tail. Two more bits of light. One. And two. Excellent. Alright, so we'll pop you down there. And... Is that still recharging? Okay. There we go, just in time. Marvellous. Right, we've got a big wave coming. Yeah, hello. Well, Let's wave to the big wave. Okay, so you're not gonna do anything. Let's stick one of you there. Okay, and do the same here. I think you could use a little help. There's a little help. Okay, I think we've got this uh, pretty much sorted out. I want another walnut there, another tall nut rather there. I think a couple more cat towels would be nice. So let's do some saving up, shall we? Had a balloon zombie, yes. Either that or it just got popped instantly, which given this lot is entirely possible, let's be honest. Okay, so another cat tail. I do like cat tails. Okay. Defending. I don't think you actually are, to be honest with you, but let's do it anyway. There we go. At this point, I think a good defence is a good offence, to be honest with you. The fact that we'll be able to put so much damage across the board so quickly means that things are struggling to get down and eat uh, our plants, which is a good thing. Right, okay, so we'll stick you there. That cat tail will be... There we go, recharged. Stick you there, and I think we've got to have 125 in just a second. Just like that, there we go. So, there's our basic defences. Want to replace these two if we can. Uh, in fact, let's change that one. A little bit more sunlight will change the other one as well. There we go. Alright. And here's the final wave. Stick that there quickly. And if we get a, a tall nut it's quickly enough, if not we'll put a squash there. There we go. Job done. A bit noisy now, always does. But we've got plenty of time. And they're gonna take care of these bucket head zombies really quickly now. There they go. Things have got a little bit quieter, thank goodness. And we're left with a postcard from the zombies which we'll read next time. So until then, 
I've been Simon Parsons. This has been Plants vs. Zombies. Thank you. And good night.